Good night, love. Gaza should have never happened. That was an invasion, not war. Israel and U.S. is at fault. No country will follow the rules of war after that. Good morning, my love. Good morning, love. I still didn't get that picture yet, sad face. It's pending. I don't know why it takes so long. Because of all of the harassment and bullying in the past 17 months from these YouTube vloggers, the lawyers are filling suit against four of them. He had great insight on the situation. I will send a copy to you through attorney. Smiley face. That's good news. Yes. So, we aren't going to say too much after I make this statement to you. Do not respond. Madison did an interview as a former friend of mine to three bloggers. The problem is that she lied. I met you in October 2020 and was single at the time. I met her in July 2021 at KOD as the Sunday promoter. I left KOD in November 2021. We never spoke about me knowing you or my personal business. I only started going out meeting up with her after September 2023. She found out about this me, you, YouTube situation. One week before my November 2023 Tasha K interview, she lied on that interview and said, we spoke about you, never happened. The only person who knows my business is Yvette. And when all the drama happened in January, she told me Shirley called her and offered to pay to move her. Lie. At this point, all secrets are out. The first six months of the phone calls tell it all. I don't know why she felt the need to insert herself in this mess. And I never spoke ill of her. I thought she was a cool person in spite of everything we heard about her. I think she let her friends guide her. This is why I keep to myself. All of this unnecessary drama going on. This hateful energy these strangers have is crazy. I keep happy energy through it all. Some. Every day it's something. Damn. We'll leave at that. How are you feeling today? How's your health sleeping in knees? Just one day at a time, baby. I hear you, love. Just know I love you, smiley face. I love Umor. Good morning, my lady. Happy to know you're doing better today. I miss you. Good morning, handsome man. I miss you like always. Someone texted me this morning about the blogger whose channel was removed. Said the girl is crazy. She blames me for her channel being removed. Just for attention. It's sad how they insert me in their life for attention. I hear her new page is all about me and you. Lowell, I'm glad I could help pay her bills. Smiley face. It's elementary at this point. Her beef is with herself. I don't even know her. She constantly spoke lies and insults about me like it's personal. She has real anger issues and comes off very unhappy and unhinged. Listening to her will make your ears bleed. Unhappy, jealous behavior. She's done this in the past, I hear. The girl gave me a long history of this blogger and her past issues. This is not the first time she's attacked people with her mouth. Smiley face straight men are a woman's best friend. Lowell. No drama there. Wow! Hey, my day went great. How are you? It's going, baby, but I'm happy your went great. As for me, I've learned a lot. One of my cellmates got life plus 60 years. Life is too short to be going back and forth debating with anyone when you're free. I'm saying don't risk your life on pettiness. You can mean well, but others carry a different agenda. I have to stay focused and my faith in God if he's protecting me on this journey. I've asked him to cover you as you're being attacked from all sides every week. So it's good to have a great week. I appreciate that. The hate is real. This situation has gone to shit. Me believing you, being your friend, and supporting you these lies has took on another life. Now it's let's find out dirt on Sonia. You would think these strangers didn't have a life. I have enormous support that believes the county has lied and unlawfully charged you. That sees what's going on. YSL case has opened a lot of eyes to how unjust the court system is. They said no evidence on Thug, that's why they are putting pressure on his associates to lie on him. This world is corrupt, and most of the people in it. I'm glad you have your faith to keep you safe. How do people live in dirty homes? And yes, my day was great. Russia is ready to drop a bomb. They said New York and D.C. is first to be hit. Put in is done with the U.S., the local news will not report on it because of panic. They want us to keep moving normal until, boom. I watch this independent reporter. He gives a daily report of the world issues. It's bad. I think the U.S. want this. It's money and war. The stocks in these companies that provide ammunition and weapons have, with, through the roof. They sold the White House last month. 
They didn't report that either. It's going down. Call me crazy, but I pay attention. We got food, water, and protection. Reset this world. You can't stress what you can't control. You can't give energy to people that don't support you. A wise person told me, keep your chin up. Has anyone noticed that the news only report on black crime stories? I haven't seen a non-black crime story aside from mass shooting. It's a narrative they push to make it so no one value blacks, even blacks. I think no other race behaves like this. They're snatching kids, selling organs. We need to be on an island with no internet. Sorry for the dressing convo. I think I need to RV love you. I had an offer to consult for a club owner in LA. I declined the position. I'm lazy. I don't have the energy to deal with people I would do back office only. I don't want to deal with customers or employees. In Miami, it was cool. I was younger, healthier. My first five years in Miami was the best. Florida is the best to live in now. I don't agree with everything the governor does, but most, yes. The cost of living in most cities has caught up with Miami, but the wages, no. They keep building new apartments here, now asking 2.75 times the rent. Wages in Georgia have not matched cost of living in six years. Corporations are buying most of the homes. This is not a good state to live in. Sorry, we can't talk too personal because of the audience. So I'm rambling about nothing. Hey! Good morning, my love. Smiley face. Good morning, handsome man. I'm packing up this week. Ugh. Have a taste for spaghetti. L-O-L. Okay, some spaghetti. L-O-L. Have good day, baby. I'm weird. L-O-L. Thanks. I will have a good day. Missing you like always. What are you now? I'm home. I moved this month, so I will be in town. Going out of town in August. I'm trying to understand. Because to me, it's not making sense what that independent reporter is saying. How are their facts substantial? And can their info be fact-checked? I'm saying, if the bombs are coming, let them come. Shrugs. It also appears that Fulton's most prominent prosecutions are toppling down and crumbling. Thug's case is on hold. Trump's sentencing has been further noticed, and the trial in GA doesn't look to be realized if he becomes president due to SCOTUS ruling of immunity. Hey, have you ordered the magazines yet? Yes. Today. My old ass forgot smiley face. He's a reliable source. Unless a miracle occurs, war is set to hit the states. Other countries are tried of the actions and interference in wars by the states. How many states will be hit? They say two for now. Can't stress that. No control. Trump does not like war or death. I thank God for you, thank you. Thank you. For all the encouragement and support when I was hospitalized and going through my business drama in Miami. Tough times. And you were the best friend through it all. Always positive and praying for me. Helping with my dating issues. LOL. And listening to my rants. Returning the favor is my pleasure. Never forget. Good morning, my love. Smiley face. Good morning, my love. Love hearing your voice every day. I hope you're in good spirits today. Two years damn life. I'm sitting here listening to both of the Rude Boys albums from the 90s. They were real good. 90s were good times. Smiley face. How are ya? Hey, love. Just left sax. It is 105 degrees outside. Shid. Crazy hot. Waiting for my daughter to come by. We hanging tonight. Wish you were here. Ugh. I'm not doing much. Watching TV. News, etc. They say it could be an attack in NY over the holiday weekend. Just mostly sitting and thinking about my case. It's hard to make a definite direction of my future when I'm fighting this personal battle. Did you have a chance to order magazines? And have you had the opportunity to speak to government lady yet? Please be careful out there. It really easy to wind up in a situation, but twice as hard to recover from what one gets into. The support I gave you in the past was from the heart, and you owe me nothing. Any decent person would do the same. I'm honestly just sitting here thinking a lot. Watching the news now, they just reported about a man who shot a police officer. I'll be happy to leave here and be able to speak my mind. Babe, thanks for calling me. Thinking back to all our conversations before this, you were a great inspiration. You were very positive and gave great advice. You always called in a great spirit, and I appreciate that. It's so much hate and negativity out here, even in one circle. I can say I'm glad we met. You were around for a reason. Money can't bring true friendships, and because our situation had none involved, it was based on emotional support, priceless. Like I always told you. We good. No pressure. 
I'm looking at this video, Chrisette Michelle. She sang at Trump's 2016 celebration and the Blacks folks went in on her. Sad. It ruined her career. Now people see Trump was lied on and that he is PRO Black has been since the 80s. Not researching, but believing the narrative put out there by actors working for news media. It is so important that we research everything. Question everything. Stop just drinking the Kool-Aid. People of all walks lie, especially politicians who show up at churches and give speeches during election time. TF, drink up. If Usher introduced Justin Bieber to Diddy the type of person Diddy was and Justin was violated, why is no one speaking on that part? They are giving Usher all these awards after he set the lil boy up. Just as affected by what Diddy did. Rambling. Pick and choose, I guess. 90s music was great. Several people reached yesterday and apologized for being mean and judging this situation. Said they were misinformed by the lies the bloggers were telling. Some people like mess. Today's examples for the kids to follow is dad. Pushing hate, harassment, and bullying. These kids pay attention and assert this behavior to their peers. Kids listen to what goes on in the house. I remember bad rap music we never played in front of the kids. We spoke different around them. Gave the example. Now it's like F it. And these kids are eating up the bullshit. I just saw a 15-year boy get life in jail. He didn't commit the crime but was there. Crazy. Took that boy's freedom. Life. History repeats itself. Everything I've experienced in the 90s is happening. Only difference is the notable drugs. Fetinol replaced crack. Social media raising the kids instead of the parents. Like then roles have reversed. Parents plus kids. You're absolutely correct. Kids are receiving life sentences, which I've seen over and over going to court. As you stated, many things are being swept under the carpet these days. In reference to what you said before, what if I is convicted for the accusations against me? It would be too late for apologizes at that point. Appeal procedures take forever, and the ones responsible for the injustices would have moved on with life, while the ones wronged sit and rot, waiting for justice to prevail. I know I cannot dictate my situation, but it's difficult when you're innocent and forced to endure the persecution while traveling the road of this difficult journey. So true. No one looks outside their wants and needs. No one should sit in jail or catch a case. Innocent. I know several people who lied on men causing them to catch cases, not caring about the lie told to ruin someone. Selfish people. When I worked with the criminal defense attorney, I saw so much unjust. And these attorneys pushed them to take pleas. Innocent. T.F. Not caring about that person's future. A record haunts you for life. Why be an attorney if you don't care about the true justice? Don't become a doctor if you truly don't care for saving life. People get caught up with the title and groupies. No love out here? The devil has won. This woman in Detroit lied on their dude called Grape because A refused to give her money. He won the case. But the fear, the money spent, the time lost. Plus people looking at this dude like he did it. The attorney was a beast. Last of the greats. No punishment for the girl who lied. It's no justice in the court system. It's a tool to fuck people over and tax them. Look at why it was created. Slavery. And these black politicians have made no difference. Pushing the same racist agenda the white man put in place against us. It's about convicting the guilty, not conviction percentage. Too many innocent people in ale. Politicians never care about the people. Financial gain and power. A man said this generation is worse than anything imaged. Our race is the most divided. We are doomed. Values gone. Love gone. Respect gone. Our grandkids are screwed. These new parents do everything in front and around the kids. Allow disrespectful behavior. I stay away from the youth. Jails and morgues full of kids. This was by design. After slavery ended, they should have sent us back. The treatment is deplorable. These new apartments are built like RVs. And some homes. Quality gone. I'm talking RV under 200K. There are throwing up new apartments everywhere. Who is moving here? Wages low come high. No black unity. It's very clicky here. You know me, I stay to myself. I think because of how busy my life was up until 2020. I enjoy just hanging with my kids. It's peace. They're trustworthy and dependable. No habits. No drama. I raised good people. I'm hugging you hard. Feel the love and support. 
Yes, I do. Thank you, smiley face. Love you. I was thinking about how this legal situation interrupted your life, hurt important relationships with people you care about. I know you're not an evil person, and that there are things you want to say to them. And the longer it takes to express and speak your heart and mind could make one go crazy. You could write a letter, send it through Joe. I know your heart is good. You showed that with your concerns for my health and happiness. Show beats a tell. All of your talks about your love for God and helping people, I remember. My past has prepared me for a lot. Stay positive, the whole truth is coming. There's this attorney I want to send to you. He's one of the best. You let me know, smiley face. Good morning, my love. Send the attorney today so I can see for myself, smiley face. Okay, I'll call and set up the appointment. I hope he's nothing like Crail Lewis. He was the worst attorney. Okay, no one came today, baby. Nesto, today was a great day. Happy Friday. I saw some good movies. Watched the 2004 BT Awards. A big difference from 2024. Ugh, it was a good show. 2004. Thanks for my breakfast call. My health is good today. Hanging with my daughter later. Thinking I need a new wardrobe. Change it up a little, smiley face. L-O-L, L-O-L, L-O-L. Okay, love. Smiley face. I miss you. Chin up. Positive vibes. Okay, enjoy hanging out with your daughter. Now that's a good thing I like seeing you two enjoying each other. That's a good feeling. Being free with your babies. Who loves you. Forever. Smiley face. You know I know. Freedom is life. You have the best personality. I'm getting dressed. 56 this year. Time is moving. Sheesh. I was speaking with a vet trying to see what we're doing for our 56th. What's a fun trip? You know I hate long flights. But something different. I'm thinking Spain. I'm cool as long as I fly with someone. Or Costa Rica. Passport ready. Okay, that be me. Can't wait. Smiley face, I love you. Me either. I love you, smiley face. Good morning, love. Call on the 404. Good, my lady smiley face. Hey, babe, you notice I don't really cuss when writing LOL. Yes, baby, I did notice you don't cuss when you wrote LOL. Right. How funny. I really miss you. I'm just sitting here shopping for furniture. Ugh, it's exhausting. I miss you too. Sad face. Your glasses come Wednesday Magazine Friday. Yay. Did you get the books, baby, yet, baby? Yes, boo. They're gonna hate on the effectiveness between us. Lol. Something to say negative. Strangers in our life. Smiley face. Affection. Good morning, my lady. Good morning, my love. Did you know I can't sing? I miss you, sad face. I miss you more sad face. I was invited to a pool party in Midtown. Every week, I'm invited. I don't think they realize how old I am. I'm not going too hot outside. Plus, not trying to be recognized. Ugh. I'm relaxing. Instead, I have a visit coming up. Yay. Health is good today. I went to brunch. Food was good. My son is loving being back in Florida, way better state, black friendly. I watched this podcast about the demise of the black race. Remember the song Self-Destruction? We're there. They spoke on how much hate inside our community, how black politicians do not help the black community. Muslims are very united. My dad always have to the community and tried to better their situation. His school was free to everyone. No leaders in our community. They all sold us out. Dad always tried to help the community. I understand that with the trying to help the community and being sold out. Look at me now. Sad face. I know. You said you don't think the women were behind the lies on you. I believe that the police and DA removed and added facts to make those situations criminal. Nothing is adding up. The bank statements, the timelines, the locations, nothing. The texting between you all, nothing. I spoke with an attorney that used to work in that office. They said the DA pushes them to lie in court, make up and withhold evidence anything for a win. They said they left because their conscience wouldn't allow them to railroad innocent people in jail. That's why some prosecutors turn into defense attorneys. It's sad, no humanity. I know, sad face. Just made dinner. It's raining. Missing you. Feel better. Two years tomorrow, ugh. Okay, I love you. It's two yes today, lol. What day your attorney is coming? I'll see tomorrow. The holiday was last week. I'll schedule it this week. Get your notes together. He's not free. Tadusais. Risalen. I love your more. Good morning, my love. Hi, you. You know, it still did not get the pick yet, sad face. Damn, I sent it over two weeks ago. I'll send another today. Lol, smiley face. Are you ready? Smiley face, I don't have too much to do today. Getting tea for this move. We decided to hit up Paris. 
although I heard it was ghetto there, a small Europe tour. It's hurricane season, so no Caribbean spots until after December. I need a hobby. Okay, thank you for today. I needed that smiley face. Love your face. I listen to everything you say in detail. I watch all your dumb moves. I see you listen to me about the hair, too. Red. I'm just sitting here waiting for a conclusion to all this nonsense. Life on pause for now. I'm still conflicted with the defense team discourse from earlier. Is that in regards to the non-indicted case? Anyway, I'm happy to know you're in high spirits and doing well. Anyway, I'll teach you why I'll love you. I listen to all that you say. We go back. I got you. You be on point with a lot of things. Smart dude you are. Never steered me wrong. Everything great but what's going on with you. Happy to see you always. Love you.